Hello friends, it's Frankie with Meekspace.org. Hey, I wanted to take a moment to show you how to download videos from tv.jw.org using the browser Chrome. All you really have to do is install an extension and uh, you'll be able to do this. So first thing you'll do is open up Chrome. If you don't have Chrome, you'll need to go to uh, Google and download Chrome so that you've got it installed. You'll open it up and in the top right corner you'll go to the little three lines that say customize and control Google Chrome go down to settings under settings go to extensions you notice the one you want to get is called video downloader professional I have mine disabled just so I can show you how it works but you want it's called video downloader professional so click on the get more extensions in the search box do video downloader professional you'll notice under extensions it shows up usually the first one and uh, it's the one that's rated uh, really high it's been downloaded many many times and it's by start pages 24 video downloader professional so install that once you've got that installed um, it should show up under your extensions now mine's disabled so I'm gonna go ahead and put a check mark mark in it. Now notice up in the far right corner what happens when I do this. I'll put a check mark there. Now I get a little movie spool up there. So what we'll do is we'll close out of the uh, extensions box. You'll want to go to tv.jw.org and you'll choose uh, you know one of the uh, broadcasts that you want to watch and uh, like we're, this is the December go ahead and hit play once you hit play go ahead and pause You notice in the top right corner you get a red down arrow click on that and then here it says it found a video and that's the December 2014 uh, broadcast and so you notice it's already in mp4 format which is what we want so just go ahead and hit the download button and go ahead and tell it where you want to put it at so really that is all there is to downloading videos from tv.jw.org uh, using Chrome it seems to be a little easier than the plugin for Firefox with Firefox you have to actually copy and paste the link and then change some things in the link it's just a little more confusing so I would recommend using Chrome and using this add-on thanks for watching this tutorial and I hope it helps you so that you can help others.